A Jewish community members coming together to acknowledge the 100th day since Hamas attacked Israel. Reporter Alyssa Munoz went to Santa Fe where they held a march today. People from all over the state today coming together to march in solidarity, walking these streets right here in Santa Fe to bring awareness to the over 100 hostages that are still being held captive. It's time for the hostages to be released. Rabbi Martin Levy and other people marching from the Jewish Community Center to the plaza and back, some holding signs of hostages and chanting. Bring them home! Bring them home! According to the Jewish Center, throughout the 100 days, almost 250 people have been held hostage, and over 100 of those hostages are still being held captive. They say hostages range from one-year-old to elders. I think if people would sit down and talk to one another and listen to one another's story and try and understand the, the importance of the state of Israel as a sovereign nation and understand also the importance of the plight of Palestinians and what they're going through. One man we spoke to says it's important for the community to bring awareness, but it will take more than this to get it done. They're held by a terrorist organization and they gain nothing by releasing them. Right? We can ask as much as we want, but they're not going to be released just by asking. It will take concerted action and it will take a lot of support from other countries to put pressure on the terrorists to release the hostages. They're not only asking to put pressure on world powers, but also United States leaders to help bring those hostages home. Reporting in Santa Fe, Alyssa Munoz, KYT Action 7 News. Alyssa, thank you. President Joe Biden sending out a statement on his recent efforts, saying in part, Secretary Antony Blinken was back in the region this past week, seeking a path forward for a deal to free all those still being held. I look forward to maintaining close contact with my counterparts in Qatar, Egypt and Israel to return all hostages home and back to their families.